This piano music is so beautiful. Hi friends, my name is Alyssa and this is Dreaming of the Farm. Thank you so much for clicking on this video today. Today we are headed to Crate and Barrel for Spring 2024. I am so thrilled to share with you everything Crate and Barrel has for spring. They have so much outdoor dining happening, lots of beautiful florals, and lots of glorious neutrals. But before we dive into this video, please make sure you subscribe to my channel where I share home decor, motherhood, lifestyle, and shop with me. And don't forget to like and comment on this video. I could really listen to that piano music over and over again. So today's music is brought to you by Jeremy Blake. He's really cool. You should check him out. I love music. All right, so back to Crate and Barrel. They had a, a glorious floral section. One of my favorite takeaways was the fig stem. I thought it was really fresh and a unique spin on incorporating greens into your house. And I love figs. Give me a pizza with pancetta and fig and balsamic glaze and count me in. We're also seeing lots of tulips, persithia, hydrangea, rose blossoms, peony, eucalyptus, and as always, they have lots of pomace grass. So I love the way they curated the florals and greens and kept more of the tropical plants together. 
I really love the beachy coastal feel that the plants on this table were giving with all the rattan and wicker and lots of eucalyptus. So pretty and beautiful. I was hoping to see a little bit more pink and purple. I felt like uh, I was hoping for a little bit more color, but um, I guess they were keeping it more neutral. How beautiful is this basket? I feel like you could put plants in it or you could use it in a bathroom as a waste basket. So cute. So let's escape to check out some outdoor living spaces. So this is called the Walker Lounge Collection. It's a beautiful slate gray and I love how they accented it with some palm and some striped pillows. You can change out these cushions for white, which preference, I like the white a lot. And they had it in a linen and a black. And they have lots of beautiful um, pillar candles and some more vases and some great lighting for your outdoor spaces. Lots of beautiful lanterns and seeing all this is just making me so hopeful for not only spring, but for summer and to just be outdoors more and enjoy that fresh air. We have a beautiful new deck on our uh, back porch and it has no furniture. So seeing the options here at Crate and Barrel uh, made me so excited and seeing all of the umbrellas, I just don't know which direction to go because it's just all so pretty. So these are some outdoor hosting items. Uh, so this is like a heavier plastic, good things to use outside. So you don't have to worry about that breaking so much. So personal story, my grandmother had um, a beach house and she had a couch that looked like this with almost the exact same pillows and my brother and I would jump on it and she would yell at us. So just seeing this furniture, like I, I'm tarnished, like I had to like run away from it because I just felt my grandmother yelling at me. I know this is probably too much information, but yeah, memory. So interesting how a uh, childhood experiences can make us like or dislike something. All right, so back to uh, the Alfresco dining collection. Uh, this one I thought was super pretty and I felt like it would be great for outside because it just looked really heavy and really durable. We get lots of wind, so I felt like this would probably be a good piece, a smart piece to have. And I love the undertone of that umbrella and just how gorgeous that was. So this crate and barrel is really cool. They have an upstairs and a downstairs and I actually take you um, upstairs in a little bit. And they accent this with some really beautiful blue plates.
So this was really neat and something I haven't seen before. So this is a way to keep away uh, mosquitoes. It's like a honeycomb citronella and it's a chic way to keep your outdoor space bug free. So you light one end of it and then it burns. And I just thought it was really um, fun and unique looking. They have some cute citronella candles there and some really great indoor outdoor candles that are flameless in various sizes. So great way to light your space and keep it bug free. So here are some things they have for, I guess you could say Father's Day. They have a beautiful Weber grill. This is just so aesthetically pleasing, so beautiful, and lots of great items for your grilling needs to keep your food safe and sanitary. And something that I really wanna incorporate into our outdoor space is like a pizza oven. I thought that this would be super cute to put on maybe like a brick patio outside and just another fun thing you can gift for somebody. So table for two, this is called uh, the Lanai Dining Collection. So very small, you can get a few of them if maybe you're someone that owns a restaurant. And let's go check out the upstairs. So the upstairs is where they have a lot of furniture. So I'm just gonna kind of do an overview of this section of the store, but it would be fun to go back and maybe break down each section of the store more. I was a bit overwhelmed in this moment. I didn't realize how big the upstairs was. I don't really venture up there, but gorgeous. I could definitely spend some time with Hope you enjoyed that very brief tour of the upstairs and if there's anything in particular you'd like to see more of let me know in the comments so this is a very large crate and barrel so I'm just gonna check out the back of the store so they have more of your bar items in the back corner and then they have more of like your kitchen items in the front left of the store Usually when I go to film these videos and check out these high-end stores, I'm really more interested in like the seasonal items, the things they put out at spring, summer, fall, and winter. But if you're somebody that would be interested in me like breaking down a certain section of the store, leave it in the comments. I'm always loving to hear new ideas. And this bowl, I always go to this marble fruit bowl. It's so heavy and one day I will buy it when I'm not lazy to carry it but it's just so gorgeous and it would look so beautiful on a kitchen table with fresh fruit or with jewelry inside. I always love to use a kitchen item to accessorize my many female items. say it's hard to leave a store as beautiful as crate and barrel all right my friends that wraps up another video 
I hope you enjoyed the sneak peek at spring in Crate and Barrel. Thank you so much for uh, watching and staying with me. If it's your first time here, please subscribe. I so appreciate every subscriber I have and all of your likes and comments have been so helpful. I recently got 5,300 subscribers. I had a video go to 100,000 views and I'm just really loving this dirty and I'm just uh, so excited for the future of it and I appreciate your support. So until next time, big hug and adios.